Welcome to another episode of the Pat Down. I'm here with Dion. Open the door. <laughs> Somebody at the door. I'm here with Dion Curry. What up, y'all? And Nakia, who showed his body earlier. I had to find a wig and a hat. I had to find my skin. Oh my God. Happy <laughs> Thanksgiving, everybody. I what see your I them. see your skin. It's all over the screen. <laughs> <laughs> what now why your fat ass come on in podcast? You know Matt Duffy gonna kill that motherfucking taco meat in your chest. Everybody's <laughs> kept out Matt Duffy and his mixed stuffings. We don't care about nothing. <laughs> Stand up and let us let us take a look. Oh, All the way. Lord. That's as much as I can do for you tonight. Some under titty. <laughs> chest look like a dirty placemat. <laughs> look like your chest, <laughs> Look like an ant pie. Let's see that newborn chest, Dion. <laughs> I got a newborn. His chest doesn't look like that. <laughs> what does your hat say? I can't. I can't read it. Oh, I eat fuck. No fucks given. <laughs> Don't cuss. Maybe you should start giving some more fucks. To be honest, <laughs> <laughs> maybe, maybe that's the problem. Man, we're gonna, get bad. we're gonna get banned off YouTube. Why your shoulder look like you wear bras? <laughs> Your shoulders. Yeah, <laughs> you know how he does you have, have that little titties, indent. Yeah, when well, you have an indent, when you got big titties, your shoulders got indent. <laughs> he be wearing them training bra. <laughs> <laughs> Ain't nothing no, training just... about them titties. <laughs> they been in training long ago. <laughs> um, Chris, what y'all cooking for Thanksgiving? Us? Oh, we. I, I don't know about my wife's family, but my my brother is a trained chef, so it's. Really good. I'm making macaroni and cheese. I don't know which brother, Eric. You know, you know, Eric. Oh, well, like what type of chef? <laughs> how the much conventional oven how much, guy. Know, <laughs> how much can he make you? <laughs> He's not a pastry chef. He's like a traditional chef. I mean, like a chef with flavor, or just a chef with chefs? <laughs> no, he's he. My sister makes most of the Thanksgiving food. It's good. Who seasoned uh, it? I I think Eric Why does. Terror game. <laughs> it, this is like I'm trying to, to find the we video. We got to make because that Chris and that bang is telling me it's like just salt and pepper right now. <laughs> <laughs> the video of Pat when she uh, <laughs> was asking about my Thanksgiving food. Somebody posted that. I can't find it, but oh my god! As Jasmine the city says, she got it. Pay time off. Pay time off. Who's paying you? <laughs> Somebody. What What are you up to these days? Off. How much is it going to cost to put a shirt on? <laughs> you really want me to put my clothes back on? Yes, I think everybody wants you to put your clothes Dion. back on. <laughs> it's 7 o'clock at night. The lady buzz is out. <laughs> they on your chest. We can see them. Put your shirt on. <laughs> and so am I. <laughs> Like Jiminy Cricket, Tinker Bell, and everybody else is on that chest. <laughs> All right, let me. I ain't got nothing around. Me. I'm sorry. Nothing like a shirt, or it looks like your chest is full of ladybugs. Yeah, yeah, I said that. <laughs> oh, <laughs> you know her, her earpiece is like a got delayed to it, right? <laughs> <laughs> so happy Thanksgiving, everybody. Um, it's been a journey this week. Oh, it's been rough for me, but where where have you been? You seems like you've been busy. I have been. I have been. I want to thank everybody. Make sure are we dropping this tonight? Yeah, I'll drop it tonight. Uh, um, I want to thank everybody for listening because y'all are killing it out there with Miss Pat settles it. Um, uh, mm. in December we go back to shoot season four of the Miss Pat show, so. I, I just want to say thank you up front. Make sure y'all check out the Miss Pat Christmas episode tomorrow with your family. Fucking hilarious. It's a lot of fun. <laughs> it is. It's so fucking funny. 
So, I, but about, I've been. Uh, how I've about been... last last week's Miss Pat settles it while we're at it, where it was the finally they aired the episode with the woman from Mobile, Alabama right. that you needed a translator to understand. Oh, that, <laughs> that was just the best. Manyan, I need my manyan. <laughs> Man, we, hey, she made me go back to my young Dro days when I heard that because young Dro have a son called a son called Munyans. As I was sitting there, I was like, I can't. I, maybe I just don't understand because I'm northern and white, but I don't know what's going on. And then thank God, Carmen goes, "Can we get a translator in here?" <laughs> <laughs> She's the one that Pat said, "You are one birth certificate away from slavery." <laughs> <laughs> Did they put it up? No, I don't think they put it up. It's a clip or in the episode, but. So, I mean, there's so okay, much more. I don't know how much you can talk about it, but there's so much more to that woman that went on behind the scenes too. That on she that was so fucking mean. She was so nasty, and she gave wardrobe hell. I don't want these Goodwill clothes. You don't shut the fuck up, bitch. Them bought by I'm the team. heavy. I'm heavy. <laughs> you on the money? I'm heavy. That's what she said. I'm heavy. I said, "What do you mean you heavy? You're not even fat." And she and the guy was like, "That means she got a lot of money." And uh, uh, she, I drive heavy. I said, "What do you drive?" He said, "Toyota Corolla that you got to roll down the windows." <laughs> <laughs> oh, he did say that. They no, they did. Did. But so she... I said, "Go ahead." I said, "If you heavy, what the fuck am I?" Because I know what I drive. Go ahead. She, they didn't put it in, but she flew down to Uncle Bill's place in Texas from Alabama to put up flyers around his hotel and got him fired. Like that's how off off she was, and then she almost got in a fist fight with people behind the scenes. Oh yeah, she was crazy. And then she at was... the end, where they like interviewed him, they haven't put it really in, but she was like literally everybody in the cast and crew walked out to listen to her do that exit interview, and she paraded out amongst a hundred people. She's like, "Y'all, y'all keep looking. I know you like what you see. <laughs> like, no, we're here because you're a train wreck." <laughs> I didn't even see that part. She she was she was she cut a fucking fool. I just well, I watched I watched the whole thing today. And that drunk lady who go to Longhorn, have you seen it Dion? <laughs> uh-uh. The mom she the mama make the kids pay the rent, but she go to Longhorn and um and uh rent <laughs> oh, lobster. The, where where she the the man just knew her tequila order. <laughs> yeah. She said, I walk in the store. She said, I said, What you drink? She said, Tika, tell it, tell you. <laughs> To, to keep, to, I've seen that. I've seen that clip. <laughs> <laughs> Man, yeah, you haven't watched any of it. I haven't seen that part of the episode. No. No, you got you got to go watch it, Dina. It's, it's fucking hilarious. I just turn it on there and I laugh. I see something new every time. Every time. I just sent you, Chris, in the Instagram that this lady took. Then the flight attendant will let this lady um use the bathroom. I only reason I could see is if it was turbulence or they was descending. She took her pants out and pissed in the floor. All right. Well, I while I look for that, I've already got this queued up. But let's relive one of the best episodes of the Pat Down ever. Well, let's see what this is. Uh, stuffing. We have mac no, and cheese. No. No. <laughs> no what? Nobody eat fucking stuffing. Stuffing is delicious. You're no, wrong. It's called chicken and dressing. What? Chicken and dressing? Stuffing is disgusting. Stovetop? Oh my god. <laughs> Don't you ever tell nobody you eat stuffing. I love stuffing. <laughs> That's because you don't know no fucking better. Have you ever had oyster stuffing? Oh my god. It's stuffing with oysters in it? Oh, Have it you ever had chicken and dressing? Is it like in a box or like what? You put chicken in the stuffing? <laughs> No, I've never mm. obviously never heard of what you're talking about. <laughs> <laughs> the look on Pat's face. <laughs> I don't like my food touching. Okay, so I want my chicken next to my stuffing, no, not mixed nigga. together. It's called chicken and dressing. Chicken and dressing. Google it, Chris. All right, hold on. <laughs> this looks like vomit. <laughs> Why would you eat this? <laughs> hold on. Hold on. Look at it. What? This white folk shit. Now I need you to get out Betty Crocker, nigga. <laughs> All right. Hold on. Say so black... chicken dressing by black people. Black folks chicken and dressing recipe. Yes. It's suggested by Google. 
Niggas, oh, oh. I'm this, oh looks my like, God. this looks like South me. Oh my God, Chris, I'm so sick of you. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> That's from two years ago, our Thanksgiving episode. It's funny, is you weren't giving us, like, <laughs> you weren't letting me have an inch. It was so funny. Oh, please send me that post. Can I get that post? Yeah, I'll send it to you. Thank, baby, this is Miss Pat. There's a whole bunch of fan pages that have sprang up that you can follow. But yeah, thanks to baby, this is Miss Pat that found that one. So I hear, he said, I'll does get, it come uh, in a box or what? <laughs> <laughs> well, I guess stuffing and dressing, like in the north, we call it stuffing, and down south, you call it dressing. Right? I think they call it dressing on there, don't you, Dia? Yeah. It, what white people call it stuffy, but it's dressing. Yeah. They call everything stuffy. I don't okay. eat stuffy. So, so you've had chicken and dressing because you've been in my house before now. Yeah, I, I think can't. you made me. Didn't you make me Thanksgiving uh, dinner once? Up uh, your soul food dinner. We sure did. Me and Gary Allen, we co- we cooked. Now, so, did you say you were making Thanksgiving? I do the greens and I do the. Uh, yeah, check on them green. <laughs> <laughs> I just thought about it. I left them boy. It might need some water. Um, uh, I it's just, better than that turkey. You remember the black turkey? You know what? Let me tell you something. If any greens, man, I wish they were still, man. Garrett bombing them. Man, they make some greens. They put you through the bathroom for three weeks. <laughs> <laughs> You better have emergency tissue. <laughs> <laughs> that's because she put baking soda in her green. Oh, this is let's go to a break. This is BT. Okay. Do you guys see this? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. yeah. So yeah. all all things Miss Pat posted this classic. Do you do y'all remember this? <laughs> oh, <man>. oh, <laughs> oh, I think this turkey got the death penalty. <laughs> <laughs> This nigga stole this turkey. (laughs) (laughs) This nigga done cooked this turkey, so it turned into a nigga. (laughs) 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 Uh, This mother look like he been tagged, got white people skin. (laughs) 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 Bro, who the fuck you think you gonna eat this nigga turkey you done (laughs) Oh, it's white on the inside. <laughs> How you turn around? Oh, I'm in tears, buddy. <laughs> I love when you get tickled. It makes me laugh so hard. That thing had black leather skin. <laughs> it was so black. My thing is, is that if you're going to do that to a turkey, then don't kill him. <laughs> don't Let kill him the live. turkey to do that. Yeah, because nobody's going to eat him. So if you're going to do that to a turkey... I, I said, but no, what the fucked up part about it, nobody wanted to tell him that he fucked up the turkey. Nobody. <laughs> Everybody was scared to tell him he fucked up the turkey. We just gonna act like, I said, no, throw this burnt motherfucker <laughs> in the trash. <laughs> they over there playing spade like they don't see this motherfucker don't niggerize this turkey. He did niggerize. <laughs> you know, a lot of times you can throw some cream of mushroom on some shit and moisture. Nigga, that turkey was dry like some, it had been put in a dryer. <laughs> He cooked, he cooked that turkey so much the pussy collapsed on it. <laughs> <laughs> and the pussy is the hole that hold the stuffing. It had just collapsed. Do y'all put the stuffing in the bird? Yeah. No, you put onions. No, we don't put that in. You oh, not stuffing, mean like onions and peppers and stuff. Stop like saying that. stuffing, Chris. I can't. It's not stu- Look, that's what. <laughs> you confusing me when you say stuffing. Can I'm you please respect like... my culture? Thank you. <laughs> You stole I keep bread. I'm not to give a fuck about your culture. You stole top motherfucker. <laughs> well, they give care about your haircut. <laughs> I'm supposed to respect stole top. I'm not gonna take this for somebody that eats racetrack pizza. Well, I don't even respect your glasses right now. <laughs> Evidently, you don't. I don't respect your taste, but motherfucker, eat stuff. <laughs> I don't even respect your weight loss either. <laughs> what the fuck are you talking about? Yeah, now? Like, 
I weighed in at 256 today. I'm I'm 100 pounds lighter than you. Just randomly picking things on your body. I don't that care. That's your neck that went inside. When you, you know what? Outside. I, don't, I don't like your beard hair. You know what? I don't even like your beard either. It remind me of Tails you... on the Crypt. Oh, nah. I thought you froze. <laughs> you know what? Your front Shut tooth. Up. Your front tooth is sus. <laughs> You can play this game, my friend. He don't like your beer because it remind him of spaghetti. Silly. Two fat uh. niggas arguing. <laughs> In your uh, stuffing. Uh, so I got that video too, uh, from Instagram that you sent me. Oh uh, yeah, man. Oh my god, y'all, man. I be dying laughing at her videos. It is hilarious. <laughs> Hilarious. That's what your thing's giving. That's how I ask you what the spread gonna look like. I hope it ain't gonna look like this, Chris. Oh, <laughs> uh, the one you sent me. Nike no, don't, don't even say that, Chris. Just put up my video. Don't just, just put. Don't even say that. Uh, uh, all right, I was playing. I was talking about Miss Pat's video. Now be quiet, Chris. Just put it up. Uh, just leave me alone. <laughs> okay, here we go. Sorry, everybody. So for those listening, there's an old white woman on a plane in the aisle. And when you hear the, oh, that's her bending down, pulling her pants down and pissing in the aisle. I don't give a fuck. No, fuck you. Fuck you. I gotta go pee. I don't give a fuck. You okay, you baby. Fucking all right, I don't think she's poor little boy. Next to us, oh, oh, yeah. Nope, paper tissues. <laughs> Here, let's watch it one more time. Oh, that was fantastic. Sorry, everybody. Are you serious? Everybody having an attack, too. What? Keep that happening in the back. Uh, they, they booed her immediately. <laughs> they she has her. a tramp stamp. Did they boo her? You say she expected she booed her pants down. And somebody go boo. <laughs> oh, hold on, let me pull it back up. <laughs> I want to irritate her. Piss that queen. Oh. <laughs> she must have had to go. She must have oh, been missed. Was, that was the funniest well, thing I've seen all week. <laughs> she sounded like she was Hispanic. Yeah, oh, I think she was. God damn. Oh, that's why you kids so fast. They do everything quick. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my God. Oh, oh my goodness. You got to take right. the volume off. Here we go. Let me pass. Let me pass. This poor little boy next to us. Oh, yeah. You got to start it off. You missed it. Yeah. <laughs> oh. Sorry, everybody. Are you serious? Oh. I don't give a oh, fuck. So no, fuck you. Oh, fuck you. I gotta go. I don't care. I don't give a Where does somebody get off doing that and then uh. going, no, no, no. I'm the victim here. Fuck you. I don't yell at me for being <laughs> Man, I love insane. that lady because she's absolutely right. You should have let her go to the bathroom. <laughs> oh, they let her go to the bathroom after that shit. <laughs> She had a tramp stamp too. Did you see her tramp stamp? Put that sixty-year-old pussy on him. Oh, that was fantastic. Oh my god, I don't give a fuck. Obviously, (laughs) the the white lady goes, "Are you serious?" (laughs) (laughs) Boo, (laughs) boo. You know what the funny thing is? Everybody in the back got to walk in it. Yeah. (laughs) Have you been in airport bathrooms though? To be honest, I know they be struck. I be hard just trying to squeeze through them. Yeah. Those men's urinals are just urine filled on the floor. Oh, I'm talking about on the plane. My bad. I'm... <laughs> <laughs> I don't know how anybody fucks in there. I can barely fit in there. Oh, that's, barely... that's half the battle, Chris. <laughs> <laughs> how how did you fuck in there, Dion? I've never fucked on an airplane. <laughs> how about you, Pat? <laughs> uh, Chris, hey, there's, no reason for... in there. there's no reason for me to fuck on a plane when I... My husband is usually home, so I can barely wipe my ass while I'm in there. Oh, you're shitting in there? 
Uh, no, I'm wiping all them super colon cleanses she done took, probably. <laughs> I'm pissy, motherfucker. Let me tell you what I did on the plane the other day. So I get up and I had to pee really bad. And so uh, the, they, the guy recognized who I was. He said, yeah, Miss Pat, you can run and pee real quick. And so I go in now. I had to pee so bad. I just pulled out my pants and started peeing. and so realized I did not let up the seat. Oh, no. Yeah. Oh. I had pissed everywhere oh, i feel so bad for you i was like oh my god it was just a puddle How would you and I, kept saying, I kept saying why is a piss hitting the floor because you know i squat so yeah. i looked down and i never lift the toilet up piss all over the place i'm in there i'm too fat to bend over i'm throwing paper <laughs> towels all over the place trying to wipe the shit up and the guy but, knows who you are <laughs> So I done pissed all over these folks' bathroom like a man. She done put the pee in this pad. <laughs> <laughs> you were pissed off in that doing club, huh? I fucking pissed all over them people's floors. So. Uh, my my four-year-old, I try so hard now to put the seat down, but she was sitting on the rim without the seat the other day. Oh. I was like, what are you doing? No. No. Uh. That's disgusting. Man, uh -huh. just please Wipe off the seat after you pee on it. My four-year-old daughter has to sit in your piss in the man, men's bathroom. It's disgusting. Oh, I just, you should, anytime you go somewhere, you should travel with those Clorox wipes. Yeah. And then now you always travel with the Clorox wipe, and then you put tissue down if you if you got, if you're dealing with a child. I'm always squatting. I squat the shit if I have to. <laughs> Even at home? I know. She had me take about 50 of them Clorox wipes all in my bag. Uh, mm -hmm. No, okay. I don't do that at home, but if I'm out, I'm going to wash the toilet down. You mean when you travel, I travel with like gloves so I can wash the toilet down, throw it all in and out? You go to that extent, huh? If I, if I got a shit and I got to sit down, I want the toilet to be clean, especially that back seat, that back seat of it, because that's where everything hit. And people uh -huh. wash out the toilet, but if you sit on a motherfucker, all they going to get on your back? <laughs> <laughs> no, it's true. I, I, my ass doesn't go back that far, but I get what you're saying. My ass go back. <laughs> I'm back is your ass going. <laughs> I, I get you're hitting the silver part, but you know. So you quit, so you sitting on the edge of it, huh? I think she's sitting all over it. <laughs> <laughs> Pretty much, that's what I'm doing. Yeah. Okay. Oh. I can't sit at the tip of the toilet. And I, I, I clean so women's restrooms. Leaning back on it like this. Women's restrooms are worse than men's restrooms most of the time. She ride the toilet bowl. Oh, Lord. Yeah, I ride it. <laughs> All right, fuck y'all. I do what I do, and it's got to be clean. With that scene. <laughs> did you add tour dates? Or I appearance did. dates? Okay. Yeah. Um... Oh, yeah, my website is down. PayPal is tripping. I don't know why. If you want to order something, Chris, you didn't put you didn't put it up there. I did put it up there. It's up there. You just haven't refreshed. Uh, um, just go go to my website and uh, order something, and then you just follow the instruction, and we'd be more than happy to get it out to you until PayPal make up their fucking minds. So um, you email Miss Pat Comedy or Miss Pat Productions at gmail.com, and you guys will send a cash link. Yes, just email us. Where is so that? it's on the website here. It's down right here under latest products. If you want that email address again, and then it's on the stuff. No, that's nobody's gonna see that. I'll see if I can make it bigger. Or you can move it at the top of the page. Also, I can do that. Yeah. So with that said, uh, Jacksonville already sold out. All five shows. I can't add any more shows. I try, but I can't. Center stage, Atlanta, Georgia. I think Jacksonville, December the 8th through the 9th. December the 16th, center stage, two shows. First one already sold out. Less than 20 tickets left on the second show. Wow. Funny Bone, Hartford, Connecticut, 29th through the 30th. Um, I will be there uh, performing. So make sure you get your tickets. Albany, December the 31st, and December. Uh, I would be at the Funny Bone. That's New Bone. Year's Eve, yeah. Yeah, okay, Hartford, Connecticut. I'll be there the 29th through the 30th. Can you ask her to remove that second one? That's yep. wrong. I can take care of it when I'm in there in a second. Yeah. 
uh, Cleveland, Ohio is almost sold out, y'all. So make sure you get your tickets for February the 2nd. And just go to Miss Pat Comedy for more. Boston, I'm coming. San Francisco, Madison, Wisconsin, Oklahoma City. Get your tickets. And I just added a bunch more dates uh, that I'm getting ready to do also. So make sure you get your tickets at MissPatComedy.com. And if you want to buy any uh, of the party stuff, it's free. All you got to do is pay for shipping. I think shipping is like $20 for everybody because it's a lot of shit in there. So just, um, you know, we'll be putting that up this week. So if you want to buy any other party stuff, you more than not buy it. If you want any of it free, all you have to do is pay for shipping. How, do, how should people contact you through Miss Pat Productions at gmail.com? No, we're getting ready to put, the, put it on the website. Got it's it. first okay. come, first serve. You can have everything that's left over from the party. And with that said, that's another episode of the Miss Pat. Uh, sorry that we're late, but I promise you, I was going to say the Miss Pat show. Sorry that we edited all this. But that said, there's another episode of the Pat Down. Sorry that we're dropping these things late. It's the holidays, trying to get things in order. I'm in the process of moving. I know it's no excuses, but by January, this should be figured out. I promise you. Thank you for hanging in there.